Two things comes to mind when I think of this person's brands. Brown, a gorgeous family, and an incredible pen. Who am I speaking of? If you guessed Victoria Monet, go ahead and drop a rocket emoji in the comments below right now. So for basic research purposes, of course, Victoria Monet is a singer, songwriter, producer, dancer, a mom, all of these great things and more. She actually started dancing before singing, but in high school is where she started writing and she told her grandmother that she actually wanted to be a triple threat. When she moved to LA, she was in a girl group actually, but because of the contract being shady, she went ahead and started doing more songwriting, taking it seriously to gain more income in LA. Now, when you're building a strong brand, a strong foundation, people should be able to say, hopefully, great things about you off the top of their heads. Usually, I like to start with just three things that resonates. Now, in an interview, Victoria Monet actually broke down how she was able to build her own brand character. You should be able to do that for yourself, but also you should do that for your audience as well. Build that audience persona on because I am the way I am, I attract this type of fan base and then move accordingly. I think Victoria Monet's transition from behind the scenes to the spotlight was very smooth. I enjoyed watching her perform her single Monopoly with Ariana Grande. Being in Ariana Grande's videos with the other Beast writer Taylor Parks because, you know, they worked on Thank You Next and um, many more with Ariana Grande. And this is very uncommon in some cases because we've heard of a lot of songwriters not be able to get support from the people that they actually wrote hits for while they are stepping into their artistry. Now, in the beginning of this video, you heard me mention the word brown. In an interview, Victoria Monet mentioned that she loves the color brown because one of the things is that she, it reminds her of home. And obviously, she don't always wear brown. She wears earth tones, but I love that she has combined this with her branding. She reminds me of Jenna Jackson in a space of not only their soft voice, but she can be sexy, but she can also be sweet and warm, kind of like brown sugar with some honey, but also a nice brown stiff drink. I love the consistency and the creativity of Victoria Monet's rollouts and her wordplay. I really feel like she is in control of her narrative. To me, Victoria Monet represents divine timing, um, gaining great confidence, stepping into your own, into the spotlight, and getting all that you deserve with all your great abilities. So I love her. I'm rooting for her. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below.